And while scrolling on TikTok or YouTube, you're likely to come across emerging trends like this red light therapy. But sometimes it's difficult to know if what you're learning or promised is backed by science. Reporter Elizabeth Ruiz spoke with physicians and did her own research to understand the potential benefits of red light therapy. I am constantly striving for better overall wellness, so when I saw people on social media talking about the use of red light therapy, I got very curious. Because of social media, TikTok, more people are trying it, getting on that bandwagon. Physician and board certified anesthesiologist Aza Halim says though it's rising in popularity, red light therapy isn't new. Research funded by NASA used red light therapy to grow plants in space in the mid 1990s. Pretty soon, NASA scientists working under the lights discovered that abrasions on their hands were healing faster than normal. Red light in particular, we're learning might have more advantageous properties for healing because of its ability to penetrate the skin because of its longer wavelength. Dr. Rich Joseph is a chief yeah. medical officer for Restore Hyper Wellness, which offers red light therapy at more than 125 locations nationwide. Both he and Dr. Halim pointed me in the direction of a few medical studies regarding red light therapy. One study suggests an increase in collagen density. Collagen provides structure and strength to your skin, muscles, bones, and connective tissues. Another study suggests there are potential psychological benefits for people facing depression and anxiety. However, Dr. Joseph cautions someone facing mental health issues should also seek out treatment from mainstream medicine, like the use of antidepressants. Dr. Halim says red light therapy should always be considered as an addition to your wellness practice. Now, can red light therapy be used by itself? No, it needs to be used in conjunction with other therapies because there's been controversy with people trying to upsell red light therapy. Dr. Joseph says more clinical trials are needed to confirm its effect effectiveness as a treatment, but what he can confirm is that red light therapy is safe because it won't cause skin damage like UV rays from the sun. But before you decide to spend your money on this growing trend, Dr. Halim suggests you talk with your physician to see what makes most sense for you. In Denver, I'm Elizabeth Ruiz reporting.